and welcome. This is Melissa Arnold with Stock Swish and Reviewing WFC. I called an option in this a put yesterday. It was a great call. I knew this would gap down today. It earns this morning. I knew no matter what the earnings said, this was going to gap down, and it did, and it fell. So I called the 2450 puts, which I called yesterday. Open underneath that. Beautiful drop falling today. Great call. And then we did as a day trade, too. So let's go over the day trade. Again, I, I usually wait until, I mean, 99.99% .99 of the time, I wait until I see the gap to make the trade call. Uh, but I, 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 I knew this would gap down. <laughs> I just knew it. And so, boom, I called it. I mean, this was a beautiful put. This was a beautiful day trade. You could still be in it. You could still be in it. Anyways, for the short, for the day trade here, we did it. And then we got the drop. Some people get out in the morning. I said, it's got some lot of targets here. Let it get some momentum going. One of the reasons that, I mean, it was 24, once it broke 24, then I said 2360, 2350. It's gotten down to all of that. This could even go to 23. I said, dream target today, 2250. But let's take a look at the market. Again, booking profits is very important, but with the drag on the market here, with the failure to follow through yesterday and today, I mean, who knows where these could go? Again, Goldman had earnings today, gapped up, fell. BAC, we day traded this this morning too, this fell. So a lot of nice plays here in the banks on earnings this week. And again, all shorts, all shorts, all shorts or puts. So we'll see what happens here in the next two days of this week. But so far, this earnings season has not been bullish. Um, it has been bearish, so it's very interesting. And one of the reasons that I've been looking at the SPY and then looking at the banks or looking at the banks, then looking at the SPY, I said, you're not gonna have the market make new highs with the banks dragging. Yes, these earnings could have done it, but most of the bank earnings are out. A few more tomorrow morning, Morgan Stanley's one of them tomorrow morning, we'll be watching. But when you have half of these go in the opposite direction, um, that's really telling you quite, quite a lot. So great day trade call today in WFC. Great put call yesterday that dropped into itself today through the strike. Uh, beautiful calls here to start out earnings season. Looking forward to it. One of the new students um, already made $1,800 uh, from the options trades from yesterday to this morning. So fabulous start for him. Hasn't even done the class yet. He signed up last week for the Golden Gap course, which is next weekend, October 24th and 25th. You must take the class to be eligible for the live trading room. And he signed up and it's already paid off. So good job to him. And anyone that's interested in the class, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a great day, everyone.